Welcome. Thank you for joining us. On behalf of IEA, the International Association for the Evaluation of Educational Achievement, I'm pleased to announce the data release from the Tims and Pearls 2011 assessments. Reflecting IEA's goal of learning from individual countries' educational systems in a worldwide community, Tims and Pearls regularly provide participating countries with reliable, high-quality data on students' academic achievement in mathematics, science, and reading. Tims, the Trends in International Mathematics and Science Study, and Pearls, the Progress in International Reading Literacy Study, are conducted by the Tims and Pearls International Study Center at Boston College under the direction of Drs. Ina Mullis and Michael Martin. During their 18-year leadership, TIMS and PEARLS data have become integral to educational policymaking in a global context. TIMS and PEARLS are designed to measure trends over time in student achievement in mathematics, science and reading. This enables countries to use the TIMS and PEARLS data to monitor progress in their education systems in an international context. The assessment results often stimulate policy discussion and recommendations for improving achievement outcomes. For example, Countries use TIMS and PEARLS data and procedures to inform curriculum development, as well as to inform teacher education initiatives or the preparation of instructional materials. In addition, many participating countries have developed research programs to analyze TIMS and PEARLS data and then disseminate the findings to teachers, parents, and policy makers. Ensuring that a nation's children are well educated is challenging. And by focusing on students' learning outcomes, TIMS and PEARLS help countries make informed, evidence-based decisions for educational policy. As you reflect on the data as described in the following presentations and in the TIMS and PEARLS 2011 reports, I'd like you to consider the potential impact of these data in your country's educational context. <laughs>